Good afternoon, YouTube. Matt M. Roy back again. Back to you on a now nice, but earlier on today, very rainy Thanksgiving here in Virginia. Yes, this is Thanksgiving Day. Um, I know I haven't done a video in a while. I know it's been really scattered the past couple of weeks, but it's just been crazy, crazy around here, even more than usual. I've been extremely busy. Um, but I have some time now, and I wanted to give you guys kind of a status update. First of all, again, I'm going to wish everybody a happy Thanksgiving. Hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. Hope they ate a lot of turkey, a lot of food. We really enjoyed our Thanksgiving. Instead of cooking, we decided not to cook this this time. We went to our favorite restaurant, Nick's. Um, he was doing a Thanksgiving Day special. And he's done this over the past few years, and it's been a real big hit. We started off with the cream of turkey soup. You get a full um, turkey dinner. It's Actually, it's turkey, ham, and pork, a little bit of each. You get two sides. We got mashed potatoes and green beans. And you get bread, and you also get a dessert, all for $10. It's incredible amount of food for the price. And once again, I want to thank Nick so much at Nick's for making one fantastic meal. I would have done a review on it, but this is kind of a family day, and I really wanted just to be there with the family. The three of us, we really enjoyed it. We had really good conversations. We got to talk to uh, the owner, Nick, and his daughter, um, Angie, who was the waitress there. And we just had tons and tons of fun. Got a surprise for you. I know over the past month I have said I am not doing Black Friday. Well, that's not entirely true. Um, Dad and I, in about a half an hour, we're going to go head over to Walmart. Uh, Walmart has a couple of things we both want. Uh, this year they have a straight talk phone. It's the Samsung Galaxy Air or something like that. I may have gotten the name wrong. Um, normally it's $140, but it's on special for $49 for Black Friday. Um, and I also want, I want to get a, they have a Farberware air fryer. And I don't know if you guys ever heard of those before. Basically what it is, it's, it's, it's similar to a deep fryer, except you don't actually use any oil. Or if you use oil, it's very little maybe like a teaspoonful um that one they were over two hundred dollars originally uh this one normally sells for uh ninety dollars it's on special for 40 so it's basically about 60 percent off um so dad and i are going to go together and i'm going to try to get some footage there i don't know how much they're going to let me film or how much i'm actually going to be able to uh, film Man, wouldn't it be nice if I got one of those Black Friday fights on film? No. <laughs> I hope we've gotten a lot more mature than that as a society. I remember dealing with those. Oh, not fun. Not fun at all. I remember years ago when I went to Best Buy, there was a uh, little bit of a squabble right outside before we got in. But I haven't seen that happen in a long time. Um, also, I want to let you guys know, uh, Baxter, and our new cat's name is Baxter. I want to thank you once again for giving me all the names. I, there were a lot of good options there. In the end, we decided to go with the name Baxter. We all, the three of us kind of decided we liked that one the best. I know one of you guys suggested that too. I don't remember who it was. I'm not in front of the computer right now, but whoever did, thank you very much. He is working out fantastically. He is one of the sweetest cats. He is the sweetest cat I've ever owned. Constantly wants attention. Um, if I sit on the bed, he'll come up right on my leg. He'll start rubbing against my face. He'll purr. Um, he even is comfortable with me, with me petting his belly. He goes on his back with all four paws and legs up in the air and just lets me scratch his belly. I've never in my life seen a cat like this. It's absolutely incredible. He is such a doll, and we are very blessed. You know, I felt I felt really um, depressed when we got Cassie that she wasn't working out. I kind of started getting depressed and getting to the point where I didn't think we were going to find our, our cat, the cat that was perfect for us. And Baxter is really turning turning out to be that. The only negative so far is he and LT are not getting along right now. He likes LT, but LT is still um, growling at him. I think that's just going to take a couple more re weeks. Remember, we haven't even had this cat one week yet, so we'll just have to see what happens. But I, I'm pretty sure they're going to start getting along. Um, it was the same thing with Cassie, but with Cassie, she and LT were two females, and it's always better, at least I've learned now, it's better to have a male and a female cat. They tend to get along better. Two female cats tend to be very, very territorial against each other, and a lot of fights can ensue. And so far, other than the fact that LT's growling 
at um, Baxter. Everything else seems to be fine. They're not actually fighting. Matter of fact, um, LT likes to, it's a funny thing, she likes to sleep under the blanket that we put on our love seat. And a couple of mornings, I noticed that he was actually going on top of her. And But it wasn't aggressive. It was so that he could play. And that's something that normally cats do. And not that I don't, I don't like him doing it, but sometimes, in a way, I think it's good because she needs to get used to his playfulness. And LT, unfortunately, was never really a much of a playful cat, but I think as he starts growing on her, and hopefully that he does, he's going to kind of entice her to play because that would be really good for her too because, you know, she's 10 years old and uh, she needs to lose some weight. Now, we all do, but she needs to really lose some weight because she's getting to that point where I'm going to have to put her on some type of diet. I'm, I'm getting afraid because um, a lot of ailments come with uh, cats. That specifically when they're overweight, their joints can really start degrading quickly. So we'll just have to see what happens. Right now, I'm actually heading over to Food Lion. Um, Mom wants some uh, ice cream that only this Food Lion Oh, maybe about five minutes from the house sell. So I'm going to go ahead and, and bring that to her. And then Dad and I are going to head right off to uh, Walmart. We'll see what happens. Um, I have haven't done Walmart Black Friday since 2006, so 10 years ago. And that was uh, to get a computer. That was an old compact Presario that I got. I'll never forget. Um, if you guys want to hear the whole story about that, um, I'll, I'll tell it in the future, but I don't want to make this vlog too long right now. But suffice to say, I got a better computer than was advertised because uh, they ran out. They actually had us standing in the wrong spot. And uh, yeah, that the, the people that were in the right spot, when they found out that we were getting a better computer than they were, they were not happy to say the least. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pause the video for now, and uh, I'll get back to you once we get to Walmart. Talk to you guys in a little oh, bit. Oh, guys, that was so sweet. I just uh, went into Food Lion to get the uh, ice cream that we wanted. And as I was checking out, the uh, the checkout lady was taking a bite from a uh, like a Rubbermaid container. And she was like, shh. And I asked her what was wrong. And she's like, oh, they had me work since early this morning. She has not had her Thanksgiving dinner. And a customer of hers, somebody she knew pretty well, felt so bad they brought her in a Thanksgiving meal to eat while she was working. Working. Uh, that is just so sweet that that really warms my heart that there are still people out there that will do that for their fellow man and you know what I, I'm almost in, I almost feel bad that I didn't think of doing something like that I do have a friend that works at another store I don't know if she's working or not today but I think that's definitely something I'm going to think about doing for next year and I guess she thought that the manager would have a problem with it if he saw her eating there but I can't imagine that they would have an issue with that especially on Thanksgiving I mean it they're closing at four so she will be able to get off and maybe have a meal with her family. But, you know, that's a long time. I mean, she was there since the store opened around 8 in the morning. So that's a long time to go without eating. I mean, she, and they around here, we only get like 15-minute uh, breaks. There really aren't many lunch periods when you uh, work retail like that. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. That really kind of warms my heart that uh, somebody was considerate enough to make sure that uh, a person that's working, working hard, on a holiday has a has a meal something to eat while while they're working just really really warms my heart so you know what that just kind of uh strengthens my uh feeling of humanity in people you know sometimes that that's lacking these days but wow that was just so nice all right i'm gonna pause the video and truthfully the next time i come on we should be at walmart Talk all to right, you a little so Dad bit. and I are on our way to uh, the Black Friday sales at Walmart. I never thought I'd get you to do it. <laughs> right? Barely. Yeah, barely. But he, 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 he and Mom really need these new cell phones. So we're going to give it a try. They're going to be the uh, Samsung Galaxy uh, versions of the Straight Talk. And like I said, they're, they're normally $140, and we're going to get them for 50 bucks great great deal and I also want to pick up that air fryer I don't know what it's gonna be like we're running a little bit a few minutes later than I wanted to so they're gonna start handing tickets around out around four and that's only about nine minutes from now so we need to get there pick up our tickets and uh, catch hey up guys, with you in a little bit. just got bit. the word tickets for that phone are gonna be back in electronics so I'm gonna head back there right now hopefully the person in front was correct he didn't seem to be hundred percent sure but he was about maybe sixty percent sure Oh yeah, yeah. It's kind of a kind of an adrenaline rush doing this, and I'm just so glad Dad came because he never wants to come with me on Black Fridays. Almost back there. I'm gonna uh, 
stop recording for a minute while I talk to the salespeople and uh, hopefully we'll get the tickets. Hey, tubers. Talk to you Success. in a little bit. So what they're doing now at Walmart, and this is really interesting. We got there early, we stood in line, and maybe what, for about five minutes at most? Yeah. And we told them what we wanted, and they gave us these wristbands. As you can see, it says right there, the, uh, what is it? I don't know if that's the right way or not. There we go. The uh, Samsung Galaxy Sky. You want to show them yours? Yeah. Yeah, you see, Dad has it too, so we're going to get two phones. They said that we only have to be back there by 8 to get it. After that, you know, they consult anybody, but as long as we're there before 8, they're guaranteed to be ours, so success. Um, I do want to get back there early, though, because there's another item that I want, and it is, you can see right there, it's this deep fryer. Well, it's actually an air fryer that's normally 80 bucks, but it's on sale for 40 and they're not handing out any kind of... Uh, tickets or anything for that but I found out where they're gonna be so as soon as I as soon as we go back in there I'm gonna head for that grab that one and then we'll go ahead and pick up the phone so I'll catch up with you a little bit later and let you know how it goes all right tubers so we are back home I uh, couldn't film any more there because there was just way too many people and it was too loud and this is our Black Friday or I guess in this case Black Thursday Halloween night bounty this is what we got from Walmart. I'll start on this side. We did get the two Samsung Galaxy Sky phones. These are for the Straight Talk uh, Walmart plan, and they're on the Verizon network. I'll probably wind up doing a review of these because you guys seem to really like those. So you got a uh, five inch screen, Android 6.0. Really nice. We got these for 49 a piece. Really good deal. Then on the way out, I picked up two of these PNY 32 gigabyte flash drives. These were $5 a piece. Not a bad deal. I don't think these are USB 3.0, but you know what? I'm just going to use these for OS installs. Yeah, they're USB 2.0, so that's perfectly fine for those. Next, picked up a Crock-Pot. This is a uh, original Crock-Pot brand, 5-quart Crock-Pot. Uh, this is the classic with the three manual controls. You got low, high, and warm. Um, got that for $10. Really good deal there. We needed one, too, because Mom threw the old one away. And finally, my big purchase today, or you could call it a big purchase, is this Farberware Air Fryer. It says, a secret to healthy and tasty frying. New technology uses little to no oil. Again, probably going to do a review on this as well. These were selling for $100, and I got this for $39, $40. So... This was basically uh, $60 off. So this is our Black Friday stuff for today. I hope you guys really enjoyed this. The vlog is going to be ended here because I am very tired. It's about 7 at night. Been up since about 6 in the morning and I am ready for bed. So I'm going to edit this up. Hope you guys really enjoyed it. Please remember to like and subscribe. And as always, have a blessed day everybody.